Kessler joining us for a look ahead to a little bit of a change up in the forecast. Mike? Yeah, a little bit of change up, but it's still going to feel and look like spring. It's the classic cliche, as they say, uh, April showers bring May flowers. That's what we have in that seven day forecast. This will be one of our last totally dry days for some time. 67 in Detroit for the high temp so far. But yesterday I mentioned a few of us had an opportunity to hit 70. Looked like that turned out to be Jackson as well as Adrian. Further away from the cooler lakes with that southeasterly to easterly breeze coming through. And that kept some of us cool, like Port Huron with the high temp of just 61. Outside right now, we're at 63. Humidity's at 34%, so it's relatively dry for now. Winds are from the south at 9 miles per hour, and those winds are expected to stay calm. But they are going to be shifting out of the east once again tomorrow, which is going to keep us cool. Right now, looking at our temps, a few of us are actually still in the mid to upper 60s. But there is going to be some changes here. Uh, here's the setup. Area of high pressure to our north. There's a warm front cutting right through the state of Michigan. That's why we had temperatures in the 60s, but Grand Rapids, uh, they reached 70 degrees as well. Uh, but what's going to happen is a cold front's going to push in, and that's going to take the temperatures back. This boundary is going to stall out, and sometimes rain can ride along those boundaries. And you actually see the rain here. This is expected to drift down towards the southeast during the overnight hours into the day tomorrow. So 60s for the rest of this evening, mostly clear and mild, so we'll stay dry at least for tonight. Uh, temps are going to hold into the 40s as clouds begin to increase. Once again, we're not expecting that rain to take hold just yet, but then it changes once we start the work week. The morning starts dry, but once we get towards the morning, late morning hours into the lunchtime, afternoon hours, that's when there's a pretty good opportunity to see some rain, maybe even a thunderstorm. 62 is going to be the high temp. We'll do it again on Tuesday and just showing you this warm stretch. 54 is our average this time of year. We'll climb up to the 70s, but even though we'll have the temperatures that are going to feel like springtime, we'll have tons of opportunities to pick up some rain, some much needed rain. There's a very slow moving upper level system that's going to be marching towards the Great Lakes. So that seven day shows we stay mild to warm, but we're going to have rain chances just about every single day this week. There will be some dry time, but we can use the rain too. That's right. We got to 